Tyler Klum, Olivia Parker, homecoming king and queen. Columbus Grove would be the ones crowning early as we've got Blake Reynolds, the keeper. First down, only a field goal on this drive though, so Allen East defense stiffening up. Now with the ball, Klum going to connect with Braden Crumrein for the first down, the long gain, but this drive also no points. So Columbus Grove back on offense with the football. Three-point lead, and this pass right into the middle of the defense to Gabe Clement. And Clement showing some nifty moves, breaking some tackles, gets a block, takes it into the house for a CGTD 10-0 Bulldogs on top. Some more action from Columbus Grove after nothing doing on that next drive for Allen East. This is Clement again, drug out of bounds, the 38-yard line. And it would lead to this, a one-yard touchdown dive by Colin Metzger. 17-0 Columbus Grove on the road, but Allen East looking to strike back. Clum finds Garrett Newland across the middle and puts it in for the touchdown. 25 yards to the house, 17-7 Allen East. One more score here. This one's going to be Clum just going to keep it, drive up the middle. Six-yard touchdown, 17-14 at the half. Columbus Grove adding a few more points and holding on for the 30 to 21 win after the game. Mark Schein caught up with the victorious head coach of Columbus Grove, Andy Schaefer. Your team had a great start to the football game. You got up 17-0. You had to be proud of how you started. Yeah, it was a great start. We talked about how important it was, and, and we did it. And, and honestly, we didn't know what was going to happen. We didn't know Allen East was going to battle back like they did. And I'll tell you what, credit to Coach Billings and, and his staff, because those kids really fought there. And, and it was a heck of a game for four quarters, really. It, it really was. But when they answered and they got back in the football team game, your team responded very well also. They did. You know, we battled adversity in the past, not necessarily this season. And I didn't know how we'd respond. But it helps having a guy like Blake Reynolds that's been a quarterback for four years. And uh, I'm glad he's on our side. And yeah, he kind of calmed some people down and stepped in and made some really good throws as needed. And now number one seed, you got to like that too. That's neat. I, I love this tournament. I love how we're doing it. And I think it's great that we can have a conference uh, champion. And I'll tell you what, Alanis, who knows? We may see him again. It's a, it's, it was a good game.